Hey folks, this is Jake Davis with an on-the-fly review for you. And uh, tonight I'm talking about Possessor, released earlier this year, written and directed by Brendan Cronenberg, and starring uh, Andrea Riseborough, Christopher Abbott, uh, Jennifer Jason Lee, and Sean Bean. No bonus points if you guess that Sean Bean dies. Uh, I'm shooting this in the back corners of my house right now because it's well after 1.30 in the morning and I don't want to wake anybody up shooting this video and I literally just finished this film seconds ago and holy shit, we have a major fucking masterpiece on our hands here, people. This is a, a phenomenal horror movie. Oh, maybe groundbreaking shit. Yeah, this might be shit they talk about for years. Um, the whole setup here is that uh, t telling the concept might be too much of a giveaway. Basically, you're dealing with an assassin who has the who has who has the resources to the technology that allows her to possess a human being in order to carry out uh, the assassination and leave a perfectly good dead scapegoat uh, at the fucking waist side here. Um, I'm not telling you anything else other than that. See this movie. See this motherfucking movie. Um, this, uh, I know when, when you're someone like me or a major movie fan or just a guy who tries to... Uh, Watches me movies throughout the year so you can kind of get your own kind of award thing out there, which I'm definitely going to do at the end of the week. Please watch it. <laughs> but, uh, <clears throat> this was, this was phenomenal. This is the kind of thing you hope to see, you know what I mean? You, you never know when you're going to come across something genuinely special, unique, and groundbreaking, and eye-opening. Earlier tonight, I posted a video, uh, my review for, uh, a promising young woman and I was really disappointed in that film and I thought my my main problem with that movie that is I thought it 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 was it was soft it copped out ultimately this movie does not cop out <laughs> if if promising young woman is a movie that <coughs> excuse me is that if, if that movie is a movie that played with darkness and then just turned around and joined a choir, Possessor is a movie that played with darkness and then ended up going full cannibal. <laughs> this is a insane movie. I just want I want to praise the script, the art direction, uh, Brandon. Oh my God, Brandon uh, Cronenberg's. Oh man, I hope I'm sure his father is so proud of him right now. I mean, it's particularly I love like little things like how colors are so much brighter, and well, that's not little, but <laughs> the colors are so much brighter and and like fanning, in in the uh, in the possessed body, and it's like a mirror reverse image thing. You see the writings on stuff that's backwards. I thought that was shit. That shit was cool. And then you got the cast. You know, Andrea Riseborough is a beautiful actress who doesn't need a fucking dot of makeup to be gorgeous. And in my opinion, at least. And she's been just incredibly impressive in every performance I've seen her in. I would especially recommend you seeing the 2013 film Oblivion. She is phenomenal in that motion picture. And Christopher Abbott in this. I never saw the film James White. I heard a lot of good things about it, but I never got around to it. But everything else I've seen this guy in, it's always like, he, he seems a chameleon. It's, I don't recognize him at first. And then he get, he's really good at it. And I look up, who was that guy? And it's like, oh, fuck, is that guy? He's always fucking good. And he might have one of the best fucking performances of the year here. I've I've never seen... I've seen actors play... Like when you see James McAvoy in a Split. A terrific performance where he's just jumping from one character to another, playing this Split personality thing. But in this, you see this guy. He's literally playing two characters at the same time, fighting with each other. And it's just, oh my God, he's fucking great in this. Fucking great performance from Christopher Abbott. And, you know, Jennifer Jason Leigh is really good. It's, she's okay. I know she's not really good, but she's okay in this. I mean, I just, I kind of felt in a lot of ways she was playing the same character she played in Annihilation, and I wasn't nuts about that movie. But, uh, man, I'm giving, I'm giving Possessor five stars.
Absolutely. This might be one of the best films of the year. See it. See it as soon as you fucking can. Great movie. I'm Jake Davis, and I'll catch you on the fly.